My sister is a professional baker and every time she visits me, she has to make this delicious cake for the family. Just take a look at these beauties made with only four main ingredients. Four different types of cakes were made with this butter. I am so excited I was able to film this and sharing with you. Hello, welcome to my channel. Please consider to join us by subscribing with your bell activated. To begin, you want to add your sugar and butter together and then start beating it up. All the ingredients and their measurements will be left in the description box for you. When was the last time you made a bakery standard delicious, absolutely delicious cake? If you really want to know how, please stay along and learn all the tips so you can make yourself a really tasty cake for yourself and family. Once you've beaten your sugar and butter for some time and they look like what you are seeing, you want to add in your eggs. The tip here is to add them a little bit at a time and then you mix. Continue to do this until you've poured in all your eggs and your mixture has nice and smooth consistency. Once that has been achieved, you want to go in with your flour. But again, we are adding it a bit at a time. And just use a regular spatula to fold it in. It's yes, it requires a bit of patience and some tender loving care here and there. <laughs> But seriously, the end result of this cake will simply amaze you. She does this alongside her main job for parties, weddings, birthdays. Trust me, once you taste her cake, oh boy, you go back for more and more. My lovely, here is another tip. The vanilla flavor was added at this stage to add a bit of sweetness and also to loosen up the butter um, a bit more. So we're going to continue to stir until it comes out nice and smooth. You would need some arm strength here. Hey, hmm. and water. <laughs> yes, so just continue to fold it in until it's all mixed up nicely and smoothly. My lovely, just take a look at how beautiful this cake butter is. A taste of it and you know you're already making your way to a professional standard bakery cake. We scoop some plain butter into our grease pan. This is the good old vanilla flavor. You cannot go wrong with this. Just use your spoon or spatula to scoop and flatten it up just like this and then put it aside for the next type we added some yellow food color onto the cake please watch carefully and see how it is mixed right so as you can see the aim here was not to mix this up completely or evenly it was done in such a way that it leaves two streaks of colors and then even it out and set this as for the next type we added some pink food color onto the butter this is really a smart idea to get different types or colors of cakes especially if you are making this for any special occasion you can actually mix one butter and then portion it out differently again mix it in this way so so that when it is baked it would look so beautiful now this is good and it goes in our baking tin as well two shades of beautiful color if you've loved this so far wait until you see our last option we went in for Nutella. Oh boy, this was really a hit. Everybody wanted a piece. It was there was something about the vanilla and the Nutella chocolate that really created a very beautiful aroma. 
and made it so delicious. Yes, so mix it just as such, not completely as we've already mentioned, and then put it in your baking tin as well and flatten it out. And for extra flavor, we're going to take a little bit of the Nutella and put it on the top. Right, let's go in and decorate the pink one as well with some cake sprinkles. It is so beautiful. These are all ready, lined up and ready to bake. My dear, let me share with you a very important tip that ensures that your cake comes out really soft and moist just like how you would get it if it was professionally done so you want to set up your oven at gas mark 2 or 149 degrees celsius and let it take its sweet time to bake for about 30 to 40 minutes until they are nice and golden like this here is the chocolate one this is the yellow one the skewer came out clear and look at how moist it is thank you so much for staying with me until this time if you already haven't subscribed please kindly do so and join the family and do not forget to put your bell on so anytime i upload a new video you'll be first to be notified here we just decided to wash it down with powdered sugar just a little bit it adds another layer of flavor and taste and now look at this gorgeous thing right here beautiful it is so moist it literally melts in your mouth look at the pink one mm, amazing i do hope you really try this step by step cake recipe and bake yourself the best thank you for watching i hope to see you in my next video until then take care and stay blessed bye bye